second attempt at um, a workout for you. Um, first one got blocked because of music, so hopefully we're not going to have that trouble again. Um, so it's going to be a, a 30, roughly 30 minute workout um, in the form of a, a HIT sort of style thing, so high intensity interval training. Um, you're only going to need a few bits of equipment, uh, the first one being a ball, um, or you can use a, a workout bench or a chair or coffee table, something like that. And you're also going to need um, a couple of weights. But for this workout and for demonstration purposes, um, I've got two bottles here, uh, just filled with water, and they weigh about 700 grams each, so we're just less than a kilogram. You don't need heavy weights, because believe me, uh, you will ache after this one. Um, I did it last week um, and ached for four days afterwards. So you don't need heavy weights at all. Um, so we're going to do three exercises. Um, and I'm going to take you through each one now. And then we'll do the warm up and then we'll go through the entire workout. Uh, we're going to do 30 seconds on each exercise, which we're going to time for you. And we're going to go around six times. So it's going to be a whole workout, um, a whole kind of circuit style workout. Okay, so the first exercise is called pullovers. So we're going to get settled on your ball, lay down um, with your head supported. You can use your bum cheeks, your glutes, so keep them clenched and your abs nice and tight. Just holding one of your weights or your bottles. We're going to take that back. Feel the stretch up through the abs and back up. Inhale on the way back, exhale on the way up. Inhale, exhale. Okay, nice and simple. Second exercise, also not too bad, um, is a squat press. So we're going to have your weights or your bottles on your shoulder, feet hip distance apart, maybe a bit wider, just wherever feels comfortable and stick your bum out and squat down and back up and push the weights up down and up so from the side stick your bum out down and up inhale exhale keep the abs tight all the time keeping your core working and that's that one okay third exercise is press ups bit of a challenge You've got three options here, uh, three difficulty levels. Uh, so the first level is on all fours. So um, hands just placed below your shoulders, knees below your hips. Stick your bum up in the air and take your chest to the floor and back up. Again, abs tight. And we're inhaling on the way down. Exhale on the way up. Inhale, exhale. Level two of that, resting on the thighs just above the knees. Keep your core tight and your back nice and straight. And again, chest to the floor, back up. Inhale, exhale. You can use a cushion if you want for your knees. Um, and then the third um, difficulty level would be up on the feet. Okay, again, core nice and tight, back nice and flat, chest to the floor, back up. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. We don't want bum stuck up in the air doing that, and we also don't want that kind of movement going on. Okay, so keep nice and flat and just going up and down like that. Okay, so ready to get warmed up. Um, let me just, I've got a heater on here, I don't think I'm going to need that one. Let's just switch that off. And hopefully my music choice won't offend you too much and hopefully it won't breach copyright laws this time. So we'll see how we get on. Okay, so warming up. Imagine you're striding over a gate, stride over the other one, and then we're going to duck down under it. We do that eight times. Go over, over, under, and up. Over, over, under. That's three. Over, over, under. Four. Over, over, under. Five. Over, over, under. Six. Over, over, under. Seven. Over. Over, under, eight. Okay, other side. Over, over, under, seven. 
under, one, over, over, under, two, over, over, under, three, over, over, under, four, over, over, under, five, knee there, under, six, over, over, under, seven, over, over, under, eight, okay, starting to get a bit warm, feeling warmed up all around the legs, I'm going to get the upper body and the hip flexors warmed up a little bit, I'm doing dynamic stretches, not static stretches, the dynamic is good, but before the workout, it's going to prevent injury, okay, so we're going to take a little lunge forwards, lunging down, hands down, take the left elbow into the hollow of the foot, left arm twisted out, hands back down, bum up, feeling a stretch in the hamstrings, down and stand up. We're going to do that eight times, so we're going to right leg this time, down, right elbow into the hollow, right arm out. Hand down, bum up, down and back. Three, down, left arm into the hollow, out, hand down, bum up, down and stand. Number four, arm out, bum up, down and back. Number five, left leg, left elbow down.
those abs tight, working them hard. Four, three, two, one. And that's one set done. Woo! Grab a drink, a little sip. Feeling good so far? Okay, get ready for your second round. On the ball. Arms up. Three, two, one, off we go. Feel that stretch. Inhale, exhale. Keep the glutes tight. Making this a full body exercise. Use the core. Inhale, exhale. Keep it steady. It's a marathon, not a sprint. Four, three, two, one. Perfect. Squat press next. Weights on the shoulders, three, two, one, off we go. Abs tight, push up. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, keep that going. Abs tight, squeeze the bow as you stand. Use those glutes, activate the glutes. Exhale, we're nearly there now. Four, three, two, one. Oh, I'm back to press ups. Lovely press ups. Okay. One, 
off we go. Reaching back, up tight. Squeeze the glutes, keep the breathing nice and controlled. So we're inhaling as we reach back, exhale as you pull back up again. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Feeling the stretch through the abs. Four, Feeling your legs three, working. two, one. Excellent, on to the squat press. Three. Two, one, off we go. Squat, press. That's good. Try and get as low as you can. So if possible, getting your bum just a tiny bit lower than your knees. I'm not sure if I'm getting that low or not, but I can certainly feel it in the thighs. Four. Three, two, one. Perfect. Press up. Come on. Three, two, one. Off we go. Oh, not talking so much now. Woo. Keep the oxygen going in. Keep the core tight. Feeling the burn in the arms. Four, three, two, one.
One. Fabulous. Love it when time flies. Squat press. Three, two, one. Off we go. Squat and up. Squat and up. Squat and up. Squat and up. Abby tight. Abby squeeze. Tight. Squeeze. Squeeze the glutes. Keep breathing. Four, three, two, one. Yes. Last set, press up. Let's just keep this going now. Grit your teeth. Three, two, one. Off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven.
and we've also got the deep soleus muscles that we're going to stretch as well. So, gastrocnemius first, nice big step backwards, both feet facing forwards, and lean. So you can feel that stretching in the calf muscles. You can do it without pressing against a wall, you just have your hands on the thigh and leaning forwards. But I can feel it a lot more like leaning against the wall. Okay, and we're going to change legs. Same position, both feet facing forwards. Leaning. Four hands on the thigh. Keep the breathing going. This is the recovery time now. Really well. them up. Feeling the lactic acid. Okay, I'm going to change over. Same thing again, stand the other leg, bend the knee and lean into the wall. Keeping that heel down. Right 
knee bent and foot flat on the floor. Left leg as straight as you can. Toes sort of relaxed, relaxed foot. We don't want it flexed like that. So point your toes rather than flexing it. Take hold of your leg either behind your, uh, your thigh or behind your calf muscle. And pull that in towards you so you're feeling that all down the back of the thigh. If your leg's shaking, just release it slightly, just means you've gone a little bit too far. I'm going to actually develop this stretch a little bit, trying to work on hamstring flexibility. So I'm going to release the stretch slightly, take a deep breath in, and as you exhale, increase the stretch, and you can also straighten out that other leg. So you'll feel that a little bit more now down the back of the thigh. And change over. So left knee bent, foot flat on the floor, right leg straight as you can, pull from either behind your thigh or behind your calf muscle, pull that in, foot relaxed. Deep breath in. As you exhale, increase that stretch and straighten that other leg out. And again, just holding this for 20 seconds. And this is the last stretch. We're nearly there. Last few seconds now. Keep the breathing going. Three, two, one. Very good! You've made it through!